Hey guys, welcome back. So today we're going to talk a little bit about transducer leveling, why we do it, and how do we do it. Uh, in this particular video, we're going to go over leveling it using a 0.1 GPS antenna. Um, these work with Lawrence and the NEMA 2000 network. So first, let's talk about why do we do it, right? So let's get into this here and pull up my handy dandy little picture. So essentially when we are not moving, right, we're going zero miles an hour and our signal is pointed straight down, right? So we got this guy right here, our transducer, pointing straight down at our fish, at our rocks, our structure, whatever it is that we're going over. This is not going to work because we're not moving, so the picture is not going to be accurate. Now what happens is once we start moving three to five miles an hour in that optimal zone, our boat is not going fast enough to get on plane and it knocks the level of the transducer out. And as you see here, now we're shooting down at an angle and again, we're not gonna get the optimal picture. So to correct that, what we do is we take a reading while we're going three to five miles an hour and we find out what is that offset of the transducer. So optimally, going three to five miles an hour with the boat pitched up at that point our transducer is level and we're looking straight down all right so now that we have an understanding of how we do it or why we do it let's dive into how we do it using the point one antenna and i'm going to cut over to a video that i had made previously um, so we can go ahead and talk about how to get that measurement and then how to adjust it when we're in the garage or in the shop all right all right, guys, so we're going to go into, try and keep the camera steady here. We're going to go into pages menu. We're going to go to settings, go down to network, device list, go into your point one and data. And then what you're looking for is your attitude pitch. You can see that is 6.7. If I get on it a little bit, you'll see I'm somewhere around 7, 7.3, 7.2. And that's what we're going to set when we're in the garage trying to level the transducer. All right, guys, so at this point, what you would do is you would take the uh, take the boat home, back on the trailer, put it in your garage or uh, any area that you could work on it safely. And what you would do is either jack it up with a jack or pull it up with a winch uh, if it's in your garage, get it back to that pitch, which for me was seven degrees. And then once you have it set there, go ahead and adjust the transducer so that it's reading level. Uh, and what that'll do is essentially replicate that seven degree pitch when you're back in the water going three to five miles an hour your transducer at that point will be level uh, giving you the best possible picture so i hope this was helpful guys um, please feel free to reach out leave a comment and i'll see you on the water